Hey guys, Dave here, um, Dave's Country Den. Um, I really have a great recipe for you guys today. Uh, this is going to be a marinated deer steak. This is really nice venison. Um, I've been having it marinating for about uh, 12 hours today, so it's really great and it's uh, really ready to go on the grill. But before we take this on the grill, I'm going to go ahead and grab some rags and everything and I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the grill. We're gonna get this um, nice and this nice tender steak. Um, it's a sirloin top. I've cut it into a steak. I showed you guys how to do that before in a video. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the grill. My grill is ready and hot. Let's go. All right, so now my grill is ready and hot. Um, it's ready. Got it really smoked. Um, it's really cool because this is an electric grill and it works really good because it still gives you that smoke flavor that you're looking for, yet you don't have to worry about charcoal or running out of charcoal. That's what I like, saving money. Saving money. But I'm gonna go ahead, I've got my steaks here. I'm gonna go ahead, it's marinated really good. I'm gonna throw these on the grill. Oh uh, yeah. Here it sizzle. And what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and put my second one on there. I'm gonna make sure the grill marks are right. Now, now you don't wanna play around with this, so I'm gonna go ahead and just shut it and let it get nice and toasty in there. So now I'm gonna give these guys some time. Go ahead, let them simmer for a second. I'm going to do five minutes on each side and that's going to make it good and uh, kind of medium rare but it's going to be really good and done all the way through so that way it'll be uh, nice and tasty and juicy. I'm going to come and check this back in another three minutes. Now this is an interesting thing because what I'm going to do now um, some people may consider it a safety hazard so be careful with doing this at home but this special recipe is actually contained bourbon and I'm doing this as a special kind of technique to actually flavor my steak really good. I'm gonna go ahead and take a little bit of Kentucky straight bourbon. I'm gonna take a little bit of construct Kentucky straight bourbon and I'm gonna put it in my pan just a little bit. And now, I'm going to take my steaks. Gonna make sure before I turn them over, now they're nicely and grilled on one side. I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of roll them around in my bourbon a little bit and flambe. Now I'm gonna let that bourbon kind of burn off a little bit. let it sell for a little bit there we go now we got it going good and just swish it around just a little bit to cover the steak really nice let's cover the steak really nice and I'm gonna return it to the grill this is really awesome it adds a nice it adds a really nice flavor to the venison. It really complements it. So I'm going to go ahead and dump this. And we're going to get back to you. Now I'm going to give it another five minutes on this side. Now that it's grilling, I'm going to go ahead and come back. And it'll be ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and get my potatoes started while this is going. Check you guys in a minute. And now... My steak has been on the grill, it's done. Through, good and juicy. Just gonna take that guy off and take this guy off. And we're ready to go. With my herb potatoes, makes a great meal. And now, the great moment. 
This dish is so great. Um, this is just a great, really great recipe, the bourbon steak. Um, it's really, really, really simple. You, all you have to do is add a little bit of vegetable oil and you throw in some cayenne pepper, a little bit of Worcestershire sauce, a salt and pepper, and you mix that together and you have a great, great, great marinade. I went ahead and marinated that for about eight hours and then I got off and came home and went ahead and threw it on the grill, got my grill hot. You wanna make sure that your grill is hot. Make sure that it's steaming hot. And once you throw your steaks on there and you get that nice sizzle, that's gonna give you a good sealing, um, a crust on the outside of your steak. So it'll seal in the juices and keep it moist. That's what, that way you won't have a dry steak. Then by adding the, the bourbon, by flambe in it, that really helps to add a little bit more of a salty flavor with the bourbon once the alcohol kind of kind of just um, fires off. Then you can go ahead and just grill it for the rest of the, the time, which is only about another five minutes, and you have a great dish. Pair it with the ooh, pair it with the mashed potatoes. It just adds such a great flavor. But I'm not gonna talk too much more. I'm gonna get this. Mmm. That is so good. Mm. It's just so much flavor. So much flavor. And the bourbon, oh, it just adds so much to it. But this is just a great way for you and your family to enjoy the venison and enjoy the outdoors. Um, oh man, from Dave, <laughs> Dave Country Den. I'll see you guys next time on the next recipe. I always say, Hunt hard, hunt safe, eat well. See you later.